Hello, I'm Gandria and I'd like to tell you a little bit about accessing GP services during the pandemic. In May 2020, I discovered two lumps in my right hand breast um, during a routine breast examination. Um, so basically what I did is I used the surgery's e-consult system, uh, which is very easy to use, and I sent the doctor um, some bullet point notes of what I'd found. The surgery got back to me really quickly. They were excellent. In fact, I didn't just put the e-consult in, I also phoned through as well. And uh, what the GP did, she ran through my medical history, what drugs I was on, what else had happened to me, and I described the lumps and the position of them. And I also made a short sketch as well, um, so the doctor could see where they were. And she decided to give me an immediate referral to the Royal Liverpool Hospital. Um, and that all happened very quickly within a couple of days. Um, so I was really delighted with the service I got. Um, from start to finish, the receptionist who took the phone call from the way the e-consult was handled. Um, I didn't feel I was left in the dark. I felt that somebody was actively listening. And it was really reassuring actually that um, even at a time when there's a pandemic that you can still access critical services. It's really crucial that you understand your GP surgeries are still open for business. You might need to deal with them slightly differently to the way you've done in the past, but it makes no difference to the standard of treatment you will get. But moreover, to remember that you're dealing with people at the end of the day, on the end of the phone, they're under a lot of pressure of the staff, and there's very same reception staff and GP surgery staff that you dealt with before the pandemic. Um, I found our local medical centre to be excellent from start to finish. They've made great efforts at all times to keep us informed. And if I've had any other queries that I couldn't deal with by phone, I've even sent them a letter, a very nice letter, explaining what I was having difficulty with. And they've actually come back to me by phone and sorted it out for me. So please remember, it's real people out there. They're still as lovely as they were before the pandemic and they'll help you in every way they can.